guys happy wednesday it has been quite the day we um moved offices today and oh my goodness i'm actually i need to touch up my makeup and because i just like sweated and i'm like was rubbing my eyes and stuff and i just yeah yeah i need to touch that up um just my face like makeup stuff <laughs> and i think i'm gonna put my hair up because i sweated so much and then i was looking at my steps and i'm like uh-uh there is no way that i only out of all of that like running around and stuff I, at one point I was, it was like just over a thousand steps and I'm like, there is no way, no way. But I still only ended up with 2903. It, I just don't get it because it was, it was crazy. It was like crazy. Um, I have a few things to show you. Well, I'm wearing one of them. You guys, I am like obsessed, obsessed with this Etsy store t-shirt thing. <laughs> so I bought three more shirts. Yes. And I didn't realize until I got them what I did like I ordered almost the same not the same like pattern but the same like they're all heart-shaped patterns so you'll see let me, let me put this back and you can see my this shirt so see how cute that is y'all like and I could have sworn I got it in pink but then I thought maybe I didn't get pink because it'd be too much pink but I got the gray and then today I just paired it with this which I really didn't need because, but now that I'm settled down at work like it was a little bit chilly um, but once I was running around and stuff I took it off but it's just a t-shirt super cute okay let me show you the other two one of them i don't think i made that good of a color choice on it to be honest um i did a green and i don't know if i was thinking that it was going to be more like teal green i do remember picking green so i'm not sure about this one but there's the i don't know it doesn't look bad it just i think i need to remember that to, to just maybe do more neutral like colored shirts I just didn't want all black and gray shirts you know what I mean or like blue I just I wanted something that was I don't know more color because I like to wear colored t-shirts but I don't think that's bad that's not bad right I mean it's just colorful and pretty and then I will link also all of these shops down below if I forget remind me if you're looking for one of them they're from three different shops <laughs> and then this one I think I already have a, did I already get a shirt in the same blue? Oh no, I didn't get three of the heart patterns. Oh, I already had one heart pat pattern, that's right. But isn't that cute, it's just simple, but it's just like a dandelion. But it's just nice and simple and yeah, I just think that's really cute. So anyway, I will link those stores down below. My favorite one is definitely the one I'm wearing today though, for sure. And again, I'm just not sure about this one. I don't know, you guys, I don't know. I'm just not sure about this one, I'll wear it. It's my fault because I picked the color shirt. I think I should have probably picked gray or black or something for this one also, but I can live with it. And I also got my, one of my, part of my Ulta haul in. I actually ordered a new straightener. I had enough points to get a straightener for free by using, also I used a $10 off coupon. So um, I, my other one just is not getting as hot as it was. So. Um, with the, all the points I had and with a $10 off coupon, um, I was able to get it for free. So that's still coming, but I got part of my, I got another part of my order. Okay, move. So I did order, this was all stuff that I got with points and everything too. So this was all, all of it was points. Um, I just save up my points like for the entire year and I hadn't used any last year. And so, yeah, that's what I do. Um, anyway, I got this. I don't like I need another palette. I know um, I just really really like these colors and it was on sale They're having some sort of like summer sale or something But this is from Morphe and it's their natural flirt and it has like the best colors in it I used it this morning, but like I said my makeup's like it's like melted off of me um, But here are all the colors Isn't that pretty? I just love all these like pinks and stuff, but this is definitely, definitely me. So I got that. And then I wanted some new foundation, but I didn't want to spend $40 on it like I did on the last one. But the last one I got on sale and I told you I knew I would love it. And I did, but it's regular $40 and I just hate spending that much on any one item for makeup. <laughs> so I'm very cheap. I buy all my makeup when it's on sale. Like I don't think, I don't think Ulta puts the prices on their little packing slip here. No, there's no prices on here. Um, anyway, so I'm trying this one. This is the L'Oreal Infallible 24-Hour Fresh Wear. I wore this today, 
But again, I don't know, like it's worn off like through here, but I could have easily wiped my face because of the sweat. So um, yeah, and I'm, my color is 400, which is what? 400 fair. So I got that one. I don't think I've ever, I've had another L'Oreal is like one of my favorites, so I've just never tried this infallible one. They also had all their body washes and stuff on sale. And so I got this Hemp's um, Sugared Banana. I have not, I use the Hemp's um, lotion a lot. So let's smell this and see what it smells like. Oh, that smells good, really good. I don't know if I've ever tried any of their body washes. I think maybe I have. I've tried their shampoo, not a fan of the shampoo. It just does not work very well with my hair, but I love, love, love their lotions. I have it all over the place and I'm pretty sure I tried a different one of the body washes before. Um, NYX was having a thing if you you bought two get one free so I went ahead and just got my NYX eyebrow thing that I always get um, that way I had a backup and then the other item I picked was this epic ink liner so it's just like a liquid liner in black why are you scratching what's the matter and then I got this concealer because I'm almost out of my other concealer and like I've never tried this before so since they were buy two get one free I thought I'll just try their concealer, so I've not tried this before. And then you got a free gift when you bought any three NYX products. So let's see what our free gift is. <laughs> He's scared of the noise that it's making. He thinks it's those pop bubble things, you know, like the packing stuff. So it looks like we got a plump finish. Oh, so it's like a makeup finish or something like that with electrolytes. Really? Like, I don't know. That just seems odd. Let's see if it has a smell to it. I'm not going to spray something on my face that, hmm, it has a, like a pleasant smell. I don't know. We'll have to look into that. And then I also got this for free. This is Juice Gloss. Also electrolytes. Okay. Are these all like they're, okay. So they have some electrolyte um, line it looks like. So this is a gloss. I would put it on by getting ready to eat lunch. And then the other thing is plump right back. I don't know if this plumping primer. Okay, so this is primer with electrolytes. I don't know, it seems odd to me. <laughs> okay, that those are my hauls. Okay, so lunch. I'll pop it up here. I am having some of the chicken salad. I'm having some of those um, little mini crackers and then some of the cucumber salad that I get at Grocery Outlet. And I'm also having a squirt. I've actually drank three of my 28 ounce water bottles um, just today. I drank one before I left for work and I've already drank two at work because I told you it's been crazy. So I'm gonna go throw my hair up, touch up my makeup, eat my lunch, and then probably read a little bit. I got to 67% of my book yesterday. I didn't read as much in the evening as I wanted to. I was super tired, um, but yeah, it, it's really good. And I'll tell you, I'll tell you a little thing. You'll forget by the time we do my book review. This is one of those books where it's called Do You Remember? And it's one of those ones where it's like, you know, sh they wake up and it's like the same day over again, but not really like, not in like Groundhog Day type of situation. This is like bad memory, like at car accident type thing. I don't know if that was even a car accident, was it? I don't remember now. <laughs> but anyway, um, but the way this author has done it, it's not even like that repetitive. Like, you know, you could do it really badly where it's just like you're just reading the same pages over and over again. It's just like, okay, yeah, now we get it. Now we get it. She has done it so well with each of the days that this person's waking up that it just still makes you want to read. Like, I could see where it could be done very badly if it was somebody who just did not know how to write it very well. But this author is so good at the writing on this that... Um, yeah, it just is done really well. And I also found something else out about this author. Like she is like a, like a neurologist or something, um, a brain surgeon. I don't know, but she's like a doctor and like, or something like that. And she writes books on like her off time. So I thought that was very interesting anyway. Okay. I'm going to head off and get my stuff done and then go back to work.